We're going to learn about I have boobs and I feel like I should know a lot about them, yeah. but I've never actually Google searched boob facts. Have you? No, Same. I've seen a lot of them, I've touched a lot of them, but no, don't know anything more. I think I know extensive knowledge on my boobs. You know, I don't know what's inside of them. They're squishy. I guess I really don't know very much about boobs. They're just fat, right? I mean, like, I hope that I do well on this because as, you know, just like some general woman pride. Mm. But that being said, boobs are tricky. I think I'm gonna do sensationally. I think Salorm is gonna fail. I think I'm gonna do all right. Well, let's get into these boobs. <laughs> Why did I throw my ass? Pregnancy cannot and should not alter the color of your nipples. See, I don't know this kind of information because my nipple's always gonna be dark. They could get darker. They're like a light brown, like a chestnut. Do you Google? Can we Google black nipple? Pregnancy nipples. changes literally everything about your entire body. There's nothing left of you that is the same when you're pregnant. No, this is false. Yeah, no, this is false. Babies are so weird. I guess we would never know because we can't communicate with babies. Humans are the only primate with permanent breasts. Like, what do you mean? Do they fall off later? What does that mean, permanent? What are non-permanent breasts? Do primates, when they're like nursing, get bigger breasts and then they go away? Or Is something? it like a boner? I feel like monkeys ha don't they have little pecs? Yeah, little breasts? like little little nips. Yeah. <laughs> don't we evolve from <laughs> monkeys? Yes, I think it's true. Sure. Yeah, I'm gonna say no, that's false. Yeah, no. Yeah, bitch. Biology, wild. Monkeys yeah. don't have to wear bras all the time. That's true. Which I envy so much. <laughs> American Cancer Society estimates the diagnosis of 13 new cases of breast cancer in men in the year 2018. People forget that men also have breasts. Oh yeah. And that they can also get breast cancer. I know that men get breast cancer. I just can't imagine that it's only 13 per Did year. Did I know that men get breast cancer? If something's too specific, that it's either true. really true yeah. or it's very false. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm gonna say no, this is false. I don't know. I don't no? know. Maybe you do something different than me. One of us will get it right. I mean, I don't see any reason that this wouldn't be true. You were right. Yeah. Many more than 13. Yeah. And I feel stupid now. Oh my That's gosh. That's so sad. I thought 13 I thought was, that a was a lot. Yeah, I was like, no, it can't be. 2,000. That's insane. So that's a lot of people, and I think we need to start building awareness and safe spaces for men with breast cancer. The darker your hair, the more likely it is that you'll have nipple hair. See, okay, my immediate is to say, no, this is false, but it seems so crazy that it's true. I feel like it might be true. If this is true, that's insane because then you and I would have a lot of nipple hair compared to other women. Well, let me check for a moment. I don't think I have that much nipple hair. I'm gonna say yes. I could just say no. This sounds bonkers to me. No, it ain't true. No, it is not true. What? Yeah. That makes sense. I have no hair. I have no nipple. nipple hair. I never counted my nipple hair. Oh, but you know it's there. Yeah. I have one hair and I call him Albert. Yeah. Just like once in a while, I'll look down and I'll see like a hair that looks like it's been growing out of me since I was an infant. <laughs> Would you ever shave your nipple hair? No. Haven't you ever like plucked one? Before? No. Oh, that I sounds have. painful. It is. <laughs> but I like that. <laughs> the first breast implant surgery happened in 1962 to Timmy Jean Lindsay, a mother of six who went from a B to a C cup. Would you have surgery before 1962? Timmy Jean, they didn't teach us that in the social studies class, yeah. but. I'm not gonna say you lying. I feel like there is so much f***ed up shit that has happened in like experimentation that breast implants were before 1962. So I'm gonna say no, that's false. Yeah. False. I don't have enough so knowledge small. to dispute this fact, so I'm gonna say yes. Sure. Damn it. Wow, was it free? Wow, volunteering. Would you ever be somebody who volunteers to have a first of its kind surgery? Cosmetic? No. Jimmy Jean out here, now it's like $10,000 to get that. Hustler! I hope they did both hey, breasts. You can't just walk with one. The first bra was invented in 1914 and was made of handkerchiefs. I feel like they didn't have much, you know, to work with back in the day. So yes, handkerchiefs. 
I believe it. I'm gonna say that is false. It was not made in 1914. It was made earlier. Uh, no, it's a lie. I'm gonna say yes. yes. This is true. 1914. Wait, as in we're... Wrong or that was You're it? wrong. Oh, okay. What? Damn it. <laughs> yes. Well, I'm glad that it was patented by a woman. Oh, I thought it was men this whole time. Jacob, I'm gonna look down her family tree because that's a pattern with a lot of cash. Get me a little Jacob, no. you know what I'm saying? Men have nipples because early humans, known as Homo habilis, had a percentage of the male population that was able to lactate. So many people were. Why would why throw in a homo habilis if it's not true? I don't think that's why men have nipples, but I do think men can lactate. Or was that a joke in a movie I saw? I'm gonna say no, this is false. false. Yeah. I think it's a no because all embryos are female in the womb until you know they get their gender markers. I took a few college classes, but this is the one I did today. I'm gonna go with you on this one. Cheers. Cheers. Damn. Weird. That's for nursing school. I knew it. I learned something in college. The most common cause of breast sagging is smoking. What? I thought it was wearing a bra when you sleep. I feel like smoking is just bad for you in general. The most common cause. Yeah, I'm gonna say false, because yeah. I don't know if it's the most common cause of breast sagging. No, no it's, it's not, not true. true. I think no, this is not correct. I'm gonna go with yes. Whoa. Whoa! What? Wow. What does that say? Whenever we talk about like having saggy breasts, we think of like breastfeeding. Right. Yeah. And that is apparently something that might not even right. be the reason. That is so random. That's so random. Well, kids, don't smoke. I feel like maybe there are some women out there who would hear this and be like, oh, this is what it's gonna get to take me to Stop yeah. smoking. Kill my lungs, who cares? Saggy boobs, I'm out. I feel like these boob facts definitely got me inspired and wanting to learn more about my own body. I learned a lot. I think the most interesting thing that I learned is that um, the first bra was made in 1914. That's so recently. They are complex, just like women are, and I'm into it. Yes, we stand boobs here at BuzzFeed. <laughs> I stand a boob. <laughs>